everybody, it's fall and we are back again with a wonderful Mia Rue Robbins. Thanks for joining us again. Thank you. Um, and today we're actually going to get three top tips from Mia on postpartum. So you have your baby, you're six weeks out and you're, you're wondering what do I do? What are the top three things that you recommend that mothers do to kind of help themselves heal and feel better? So first and foremost, I really recommend that moms tend to themselves first. And that sometimes feels really challenging, being a mother of five. I really understand um, how challenging it can be to put myself first. But um, what I recognize is that in doing so, I have the internal resources. I have the positive energy. I have the physical energy. I have the mental clarity to actually attend to my family and my children more effectively. So that would be number one. Okay, and that's really? huge, and that's a big challenge. Yeah. Very hard for us as moms. And what's your second tip? So my second tip is to really take the time to heal. So six weeks is really not that long. If you consider that we spend nine months gestating our baby, and then we go through this really intense experience of birthing our baby. Um, in today's culture, people are encouraged to like get back on track with their lives and go back to work. and. And all of that's valid and important, and sure. I really support women in, in honoring what's you know necessary in their lives. However, even within that, within the demands of our culture, we can look for ways to scale back, not do so much, take more rest time, take a nap, make sure we're drinking plenty of water. That's you know, huge. just the basics. You know, in, in really and in committing to a period of time you know, at least a few months, if not nine months, you know, of really honoring that healing cycle. So don't hit the ground running. Ask for help. Ask your friends and family for help. It's okay to have the older kids picked up, you know, by your husband, by your friends, by whoever it may be, right? Absolutely. As mothers, we always feel so, um, I don't know what it is. We, we feel like we can't ask for help. So what you're saying is ask for help and, and take the time to heal. Yeah. Right? Absolutely. Ask for what you need. Yes, ask for what you need, ladies. For sure. And tip number three. Tip number three, honor your primary relationships So and nurture them. So by that I mean um, whether you're a single mother, whether you have a partner, a husband, um, or even if it's a spiritual connection that you have, whatever your primary fundamental relationship is, um, nurture it because that will be your primary support as a mom and as a parent. So um, for couples, I really highly recommend that they schedule one evening a week where they take an hour or two and they have sacred time to sacred themselves time. to talk, to just be with each other, just be, even sitting you know, in nature or at home or unplugging, watching a movie. It's so important. It's so important. Yeah, and I think it's so undervalued because we push the one who's closest to us away, but you're right, we should be, that's most sacred relationship we have and without our partner and really one hour a week I mean we can find one hour absolutely a week. and it, it's like a homeopathic remedy for our lives and for that fundamental relationship it will keep it going through the challenges of early parenthood that's amazing oh my gosh so true those are great tips and I think those are tips not just postpartum but throughout our lives that we just need to constantly and I, and I think that's how you find your happiness with your relationship everyone in your life yeah. oh my gosh you're amazing you. such such enlightening empowerment here I love this I love this thank you so much thank you um, please check out all the information below and you can read more about Mia and all the great things that she's doing to help mothers and she's written a wonderful article for us so make sure to check it out on LA mom magazine and again tell all your friends to subscribe watch us read more and we will see you guys next week